the sod turning ceremony for the lighthouse restoration project at Fort King George marks a significant milestone in preserving Tobago's rich heritage. The collaborative efforts of the Division of Tourism, Culture, Antiquities and the Transportation alongside EIDCOT underscore the commitment to renewing this historic landmark. We are excited that we finally get the opportunity to break ground to start this momentous project, a project that has been in the works for some time, a project that we uh, started working on with the, the Secretary in terms of the Lighthouse Restoration that has now extended to the observation deck. Um, this has huge implications for the tourism sector because definitely we see our culture and heritage as a very important part of what we sell to our visitors. A two-phase approach begins with structural repairs and ends with the addition of an an eco-friendly observation deck. Habilitation of the lighthouse, which includes works to the doors and windows, upgrading those, upgrading the facade, waterproofing it, sealing it, and putting on a coating to prevent uh, further moisture intrusion, mold buildup, fungal ingress, and those kind of stuff. Uh, we're going to also be doing works to the apron currently because you'll see there are portions here where it doesn't have an apron. The deck promises to enhance both the integrity and the visitor experience of this iconic site. This project means we will have an opportunity to reintroduce a component here at Fort King George that has not been seen for some time in its active state in terms of the use of the lighthouse. So from that perspective, I'm particularly pleased. The Lighthouse Restoration Project is an initiative towards revitalizing a treasured aspect of the island's cultural landscape. I am Julia James, reporting for the Division of Tourism, Culture, Antiquities and Transportation.